Hey porcupines, this is your Pojo News. I'm Sarah. And I'm Reagan. And now for our pledges and moment of silence. Thank you. Today our varsity and JV volleyball teams are playing at home. JV is at 7 and varsity is at 5. Today we have our varsity football team playing at Hershey at 4. So come out and support your Springtown Porcupines. Business Professionals of America is a club much like Taffy and FCCLA and it's not too late to join. We're competing in South Lake on January 22nd. Competition in VPA is basically where you choose an event, you prepare for one to two months in advance, and then you get to go with us to South Lake, where we will stay in the cafeteria and either work on your events or get to know all of the other members. It's a really fun experience. You get a little time slot, you get to go in front of the judges. It's 100% worth doing. And then if you do well, you can advance to state where we get to do an overnight trip, which is even better. If you're interested, talk to Ms. McGonagall in room 216. Seat time recovery hours have been posted on the bulletin board by the attendance window. Please take a minute to check and see if you owe any hours. If you have any questions, please see Ms. Chenbert. Don't forget to turn in your pumpkins for the contest in the library. If you missed the audition last night, tickets are being sold at the door tonight. The doors open at 6.30 and the play starts at 7. What are examples of everyday courage? Keep a lookout for acts of courage in your personal life, school, and the community. Here's Erin with our senior news. Thank you, Sarah. First up in the news, check your mind for several new messages from Ms. Bailey. Reminder for all seniors, keep an eye on your email for any important information. Also in the news, remember to send five pictures for the senior slideshow. This will be shown at prom and graduation, and they can range from elementary to now. Send these photos to Ms. Taylor at sttaylor at springtownisd.net. And most importantly, don't forget, it's a great day to be a porcupine. My name is Colin Diaz, and this is our Spotlight of the Week. I have Amy White and Alexis Cooper. What are y'all's roles in FCCLA? I'm the Texas FCCLA State Parliamentarian and a chapter officer here at the school. I am just a chapter member. <laughs> All right. Amy, what is, the, what is FCCLA? So FCCLA is a national nonprofit organization with family as a main focus. It's a career and technical student organization that stands for Family, Career, and Community Leaders of America. Right. What is the FCCLA's mission? The FCCLA mission is to promote personal growth and leadership development through family consumer sciences education. Lexis, what are some of the largest projects y'all have this year? Um, well, we do fundraisers and we do conferences and community service around the town. One of the conferences we have coming up is at the Springtown High School, hosted by myself and some other region state officers. This is going to be for all the chapters around our area so they can get a kickoff for the year. Amy, what individual opportunities does FCCLA have to offer? So our individual opportunities are really in a big variety and everybody can do something different from doing things like culinary events and job interview to things like Japanese exchange programs, scholarships, traveling opportunities, and tons of different competitive events. We try to have something for everybody in every type of career pathway. What are the fundraisers that y'all do, Alexis? Um, well, we did a sucker fundraiser not too long ago, and we do a brownie fundraiser. It's chocolate chip cookie brownies, and we do them Thursday and Friday. All right. Is there any other information y'all have about FCCLA? So
Also, if you want to join, the deadline is this Friday, so be sure to go by Mix McMillan's or Ms. Jacoby's in your culinary room. If you want some more info or you're interested in joining, you can always reach out to the chapter officers around the school. Thank you all.